Hello and welcome to Process Improve in Japan, where each week we bring you updates on what's happening with Toyota's manufacturing industry. I'm Angela Corriero. I'm Kozo Sakano. Well, Toyota's 10-day holiday has begun. Yeah, just started. Open holiday has just begun. Mm. And uh, what, can you give us a little cultural background on this holiday? Obon is one of the most important tradition of uh, Japanese culture. And the ancestor spirit will come home to be reunited with the family. Mm -hmm. And uh, Toyota will have a long holiday. Uh, Toyota's ho holiday is about 10 days. They shut down all the plants and administration offices. Right, uh, until the 19th. Um, now, in other news, Japan-wide investment in 2011 in plants and equipment was up 7.3%. That's correct. Mm. The development of uh, Development Bank of Japan disclosed that uh, the amount of uh, domestic investment of plants and equipment as of July this year was almost 15 trillion yen. Amazing. Mm. It seems really shocking that there would be that much investment in Japan. Mm. That's spent mostly on uh, maintenance and repair. Oh. And the special demand for the reconstruction of the disaster area. Ah, I see, from the Japan earthquake. Okay, investment overseas was up 9.2% and there's been an accelerated push for the overseas transfer of production bases. Well, after the nuclear power plant accident, uh, we cannot expect a stable supply of power and also... You mean Japan-wide is still having some issues? Right. Okay. Right. Mm. And also the yen is so high. Mm. The soaring yen. Yeah, so they have to think about to transfer mm. their basis, production basis overseas. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know we're in, we're, talks with, we're in talks with several companies who are um, actively pursuing options all over the world. Okay, so the mass production of the electric version of the RAV4 is set to begin in 2012 in Ontario, Canada. Yeah, that's in Woodstock where I have visited uh, a few times. Mm. And the Toyota decided to uh, start production, mass produce RAV4. Uh, the electric version. Electric version. Mm. Uh, How exciting! Yeah, that's a sports utility vehicle. It's an excellent car, I love it, I've always wanted it. Mm. And then Toyota has been developing with uh, Tesla motors. Uh, I see. Exciting. Good news for Ontario, Canada. So they're actually making component parts and shipped from San Francisco, no, not San Francisco, California to Ontario. Hmm. In other news, the Japanese housing construction companies ramp it up in Asia and they're very, very clever with their expansion. Can you tell us a little bit about what's, what, what are they doing? Well, they began to localize the production in China and the other other uh, area like uh, Southeast Asia. Thailand. Mm. Mm. And uh, formally, they were just participated in the investment. Yeah, they were just investors. Right. Mm. But now they begin to actually produce uh, building materials. They will have, uh, let's see, uh, Well, they're establishing plants. They yeah, establish plants in China and Thailand. Is yeah. that right? Yeah, and also they're creating construction and material systems over there. Very, very clever. Mm. So they're actually going from the start to the finish of the production mm. of housing. In one case with uh, uh, Thailand, mm. they are going to form a joint venture project with the chemical and the building material companies from the local area. Mm -hmm. If you want to check into it, two companies of interest are Sekisui and Sumitomo. Mm. Sumitomo is uh, focusing on a wooden housing and they're building a house for a wealthy class. Mm -hmm. And Sekisui is general housing? Sekisui, uh, yes, mm -hmm. not only the house, but a uh, house in general. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, now, just the last bit of interesting news. Despite today's 38 degree weather, according to the lunar calendar, we are already in autumn. It sounds kind of unbelievable and shocking. The weather has been very unusual, but uh, in the past, it was still 
farmers or fishermen are making a living. They live in harmony with nature, according to the law of nature. Uh, that's more natural. But again, <laughs> these days the, the weather has been very much disturbed. Hmm. All right. Uh, thank you for joining us. For more information, please log on to our website, www.processimprovementjapan.com, and we'll see you next week. Hopefully with a little bit of a, a cooler temperature. Thank you. I hope to have a gentle breeze. Yeah. <laughs> see you next week. Thank you.